Well, hello, my friends, and welcome again to the complete Kotlin developer course. We have started learning about the control, the basic control flow in Kotlin, and we have learned about the comparison operators, and we have learned about the six signs. These are the equal, equal, checking for the equality, does not equal, the less than, less than or equal, greater than, or uh, greater than and equal. Okay, so these are the six operators. Each of the examples above tests just one condition. Thanks for George Boole. This is the invent who invented Booleans. He had much more planned for it than these humble, humble beginnings. So he invented Boolean logics and the bull bool and the logic logic operators which lets you combine multiple conditions to form a result one way to combine conditions is by using and and or operators when you and together two booleans the result is another boolean if both input booleans are true then the result is true otherwise the for the result is false how does this mean in Kotlin? In Kotlin, the operator of for Boolean AND is AND. AND. AND operator is equal to double AND. Okay? AND the full, the OR operator is denoted by two vertical slashes okay so let's start by the and in kotlin the operator for the boolean as i told you it is denoted by two and signs so i will create val called and the constant equal to true and true so this in this case it will be true if either of the one of the values on the right was false then and would be false so true and true true false and false false true and false 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 and true false let me run and see. So this, you can see here simply, you can see here, guys, if you hover your mouth, mouse, Boolean expression can be simplified, simplify Boolean expression, and it is true. Now let's check false and false. Okay, if we simplify the Boolean expression, it would be false. So false and false equal to false. True and false, if we hover and simplify, it would be false. And again, again, false and true would be false again. Okay, so true and true. If we print it, it will give us the same result. So print and constant, okay? Let me run and see and the check. I will comment this from the previous exercise. And it will give us true. So if we change false here, let me run again and see. It will give us absolutely false. Okay, so this is the end operator this is the logic operator of and okay another way to combine conditions is by using the or operator so i will move this to here and let me see so the logic operator the and and we have take an example about it and the or operator 
I will create a new constant here called or constant equal to when you or together two booleans the result is true if either of the input boolean is true only if both input booleans are false will result will result in false so in cut in kotlin the operator for boolean or is two vertical slashes like this so true and false as i told you when checking for the or equality uh, the or operator and the logic if one of the two is false we can get it as when when the uh, one of them is true is uh, true true or false false uh, true true false or f false it will give us false false and or true it will give us true and the true or true absolutely it will give us true so this is the usage of true in this case or will be true if both values on the right this is the the true or uh, false if both were true then or would be true and we have seen, seen this okay now in kotlin boolean logic is usually applied to multiple conditions maybe you want to define to determine if two conditions are true in this case you would use and and if you only care about whether one of the condition is true then you would use or okay for example consider these uh, codes i will uh, make as exercises here val and the true equal to one less than five and 15 less than 100 what do you think about this one less than five it is first of all it is a constant called and true it will it have an and operator so it will con it will compare the condition the boolean this it will end uh, the boolean from the left side and the boolean from the right side so what is the result the boolean result of this on the left one less than five yes it is true so i can put it true 50 greater than uh greater than uh, let me make it 10 50 greater than 10 yes it is true so true and the true it will give us true so let me allow Kotlin to make this calculation for me simplify boolean expression here and it will give me false because I have made 100 again simplify it is true now if I put 100 here it is false here and true here true and false it will result in false okay now if I use the or true or false it will return for us true okay so this is the 
functionality this is the logic how uh, how kotlin will work and how kotlin separate the conditions and compare them by using the logical operators